Yeah, so my story is basically the same as everybody else's. You know, growing up in the hood, it's no joke. You walk out the house and you know, you gotta do some things that you're not, really, you're not gonna be proud of. You gotta do some things that you don't prefer to do. Fortunately for me, it was selling drugs. So I woke up, typical day, on the streets till about six o'clock, and then some gray car pulls up. Uh, it was just going through the routine, you know, hop up to the window, ask him what he wants, tell him what I got, and then things just changed. Uh. Yo, you got that can? Yeah, bro, of course, I got everything. Here, take this, 20 bills. Yo, you got that 20? Yeah, man, I got you. From that day on, I knew, if I'm leaving my house, I gotta stay strapped. If I'm packing, I gotta be stacking. You know, that's just the, that's just the rules of the road. So, from then on, I guess that's just how it was. And I'm, I'm thankful of the Second Amendment because, you know, even though all law might not be held up to in the ghetto, you know, the fact that I can walk around and be strapped, that, that's, a, that's a big thing. And I need to have that, that right backed up.